Okay, it's time for another 3 Minute Miracle, and today I'm going to show you how to use one of my favorite programs called Picasa. Now, if you haven't already done so, you should go ahead and download Picasa from picasa.google.com. It's a free program, and it's a great way to edit your photos quickly and easily, and keep all your photos organized in a photo library. Now, to start off today, we're going to choose a picture at random. Uh, we could go with this uh, baby trying to get another beer at the keg, but I think we're going to try and use another photo that's a little bit more detail we can use. Now this is a great shot, not because of the handsome guy that's in it, but because uh, it's got a little bit of darkness in the, the background here, we got some red eye action going, a little bit of facial blemishes here, and we're going to go ahead and fix all these uh, really quick. So to start off I'm going to use the I'm feeling lucky button, it's going to go ahead and brighten up the whole photo a little bit to uh, give it a lot more clarity, take out the extra levels that you can't see. Next we're going to go to the red eye reduction tool, which will automatically select the red eye in the, these photos. If it doesn't select them right away, you can also drag and uh, select the rest of the red eye in the picture, which will fix those red eye issues right away. And once all of them have been selected, you go and go ahead and hit apply, which will apply those changes. Click so right. Next, uh, we're going to go ahead and use the fill light tool to fill in some of that background light to get a little more action going in the back there and give everybody a little bit more definition. Next, we're going to go to zoom in down here at the bottom, which will allow us to zoom in a little bit on the facial features and retouch the face in certain parts. So, uh, we're going to use that to fix some, um, some facial blemishes there. Basically, you click on a point that you want to fix, and then go to another point on the face that you want to use to fix those facial blemishes. And that's as simple as that. Go ahead and zoom back out. It looks pretty good. Hit apply. Uh, next, we're going to go into tuning. Uh, give it a little bit more temperature. We're going to use Color Warmify to give everybody kind of a tan action going. Then, uh, if we wanted to, we could always go into highlights and highlight a little bit more. Or use shadows to give it a little bit more darkness to it. But uh, I think we maybe do a little bit of shadow. Looks good. And uh, that's pretty nice. So, uh, after that, we might go to Warmify to kind of give the whole picture a warmer feel. Um, if it was blurrier, I'd say we could go to sharpen and use that sharpen tool, but it's not so much so, so we can kind of not worry about that for the moment. Uh, the last thing I'd like to do is sort of crop it so that we have just uh, me and Molly here in the photo, and uh, kick it off. So there we go. Great photo from Terrible Photo in uh, three minutes or less. Then all you have to do is hit save, and you're good to go. It'll also save a backup file in the event that you want to go back to the original. But uh, yeah, for the most part, I do some quick, easy fixes in Picasso. Um, that's it.